Yo, what's going on guys? So today I'm going to be showing you what is going on uh, or what should happen in the new import export update uh, the, uh, the, the buildings that you have to buy and all that stuff my secretary is obviously going to tell us everything that we need to know so I'm just going in here and then just checking um, you have to go buy the building obviously first from Dynasty 8 and then you have to go to the place you have to buy the war stock cars if you need to uh, get in cars there or if you want to buy the cars that you can get in there otherwise you can just straight get into the job and start um, getting the cars to to keep in your warehouse so let's just check and find out what is going for what here because I'm actually not sure myself so I'm just gonna listen to what the chick is gonna say so I'll be with you guys okay. in a you moment. On. The homepage should be showing you three options. Special cargo, vehicle cargo, and special vehicle work. Special cargo's as it was before. The standard Securo serve contraband system. Vehicle cargo's their new offering. You purchase a vehicle warehouse, then Securo serve puts you onto different cars in the area to source. Once you source the cars, you warehouse them and sell them onto a highly vetted customer base when you want to. Special vehicle works a little different. These are complex operations SecuroServe have planned and prepared for clients, using state-of-the-art customized vehicles. They trust only their best performers with these tasks, so we'll need to make some headway with vehicle cargo before taking this on. Vehicle cargo. Okay, if you want to start trading, you're going to need warehouse space to store the cars. See what's on the market and make your purchase. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to choose any of these uh, warehouses to buy. I obviously always buy the most expensive one because I want to. Um, so I'm just going to choose which one to buy. Oh, this looks like it's going to be the most expensive one. 2.8 million. Yeah. So obviously this is the most expensive one, so I'm going to take this one. I'm going to purchase it, uh, and then you can choose whatever you want, urban, branded. So I'm going to choose the branded. Okay, you've got some space. Now you can move cargo. Click on the green button, source vehicle, and we'll search the system for an appropriate car. Soon after that, the details will come through by text. Then it's just up to you to get the car and bring it to the warehouse. Be on the lookout for rival organizations trying to hijack your vehicles. And know that you can intercept organizations moving cars too. Alright, so basically it's the same as the um, bikers DLC where uh, you can obviously, if you see someone in the lobby uh, busy moving drugs or cocaine or whatever it's called um, you can try and intercept it from them so just looking at these cars these cars are quite pricey so I'm just gonna buy like three of them because um, I should buy some more shark cards it seems like but uh, I'm just gonna buy three of them for now and then just uh, in another video obviously I'll show you guys what these cars uh, can do what they do and how they drive and you know the handling and all that type of stuff so i'm gonna buy three of them so make sure you guys tune into my next video uh to look at what how they drive the handling of the cars and all that type of stuff obviously these guys can, these cars can do something um so let's just go on and i just want to go to the warehouse quickly and then um what i want to do is i want to check because my secretary is going to meet me at the warehouse and then she's going to have some more stuff to explain and then from there we can obviously see what we should do and what we should not do and uh, yes obviously work from there so if you guys will be patient with me I'm going there as quick as I can also I'm driving with this car such an amazing car the Pegasus Tempester what an amazing car, so I'm almost there guys, just hang on a bit. 
I just felt like driving there instead of skipping this spot. So just thank you guys so much for watching this video. In any case, any time during the video, if you've liked the video, please remember to leave a thumbs up. Also, if you guys are new to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. I make videos like this basically daily. I always cover new cars, new DLCs that come out. So if you guys always want to see the new, guy, new cars first before buying them, make sure to check out my channel. I always get reviews on them, best sounding cars and all that type of stuff. So make sure to subscribe to my channel if you guys want to be part of that and see the new cars before you buy them and make sure you don't waste money. Oh, it's the boss. Okay, here's our new vehicle warehouse. Let me show you around. We're going to store all our vehicle cargo here before selling it. We can fit 40 cars in here. We got a vending machine and some personal space back there for getting some shut-eye and changing your clothes. When you bring a car back, It'll get fixed up and listed on Ad Hoc's Autos. When you access the website from the laptop on the desk, you'll see your current stock of cars and be able to select how many you want to offload and to who. The amount you can sell at any one time is dependent on how many associates you got on hand. If we want to chase the bigger commissions, we're going to need to modify the cars to the bigger buyer specifications. Remove trackers, change paint jobs, rims, apply other mods. Different buyers got different requirements. The mechanic's on site to handle all that. It's an independent operator, so it costs to repair stolen cars that come in damaged, and to do the mods. But believe me, it makes life easy. And you see the door over there? That'll take you all the way down to the underground facility. You renovate it down there, so there's somewhere to store any of those big, unwieldy, modified vehicles off the Warstock site. Only place to accommodate anything from a huge phantom wedge to an amphibious Blazer Aqua. And that's it. We should get to work. The more vehicle cargo we move, the more of an interest Securo Serve's gonna take in the company. We steal enough cars, they'll throw us some special vehicle work. Come by the office when you want to source that next car. See you, boss. Alrighty, guys. So that's it. That's what we have to do. So if you guys wanna, I, I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try and uh see what else there is to do for now i'm not going to do missions if you guys want to see the missions make sure to leave a comment in the comment section below uh saying that you want to see what the missions look like before you spend money on this obviously it's always so much fun so definitely get it i would do it um so if you guys uh want to see it make sure to leave that comment also leave a thumbs up for this video make sure to subscribe to my channel my name is jvp catch you guys in